Alright, let's retarget the Unmixmo skeleton to the Unreal. Let's add a new animation. IK rig. Choose a Unreal mannequin. I'm going with Quinn. Open that up. Right click the pelvis and set retarget root. And then we're going to add six new chains. This one's going to be spine. And then head. And then you got the left arm, and the right arm, left leg, and the right leg. Alright, so for the bones, this is going to be spine 1 to spine 5. Head is going to be from neck 01 to head. Left arm is going to be clavicle. To hand. Same with the right arm, clavicle to hand. And then for the left leg, you get the thigh. And then you want the ball for the left and the right thigh and the ball right. Save that, close that. Let's make another IK rig for your Mixmo character. Open that up. Right click the hips. Set retarget root. And then add the same chains. And the bones for these. The spine is going to be spine and the spine too, and the head is going to be neck to head, left arm, left shoulder to left hand, the right arm is right shoulder to right hand, the left leg is the left up leg, and the bottom is going to be the left toe base. And then you get the right up leg and the right toe base. And save that, close that. Now we're going to right click, go to animation, make an IK retargeter, and choose the Quinn IK retarget rig that we made. Name it whatever you want. Open that up, set the target to the Mixmo, and you'll see them come in here. Now you'll see we got two different poses here, so for the Mixmo one, you just go up here and edit pose, and try to line it up as best as you can. I'm going to rotate these down 50 degrees on the shoulders. Alright, and the elbows, I'm going to rotate in 10 and then the leg out 5 degrees and then in 5 out 5 and then in 5 and you can change this as much as you want to make it match as best as you want now you just find the animation that you want you got the idle animation there And I'm going to choose the running animation. Now you'll see the arms are slightly different positions, and that's just based on how you edit the pose. So when you find the animation you want, you export it to whichever folder that you choose. Okay, and then you're good. You got your animation. Open that up. You'll see they're running kind of weird. So scroll down over here and uncheck this right here and then you got your animation there you go thanks for watching